Hello guys, welcome. My name is Ed Green. I'm here to talk about something that will happen and can happen at any event at any given time. It's when you have to tell a person no for whatever reason or actually maybe have them move from an area that's secure and they come back at you and start brazen cane and pulling out their phone, videoing you, things of that nature. We're going to do two little scenarios here. One's going to be what to do if that happens the wrong way and what to do if that happens a better way of handling it. All right, so the thing that I need you to take in consideration is that we are all professionals. If we're in this business, we're professionals. There are certain things that can trigger us and make us go into a tangent, but we have to stay professional. If we stay professional and courteous at all times, this will never happen. But from time to time, if someone pushes your button, you have to back down, remember who you are, that you're there in a working capacity, and be professional. If you do that, things will go good. But let's go into a scenario of what not to do. We'll talk a little bit about it, and then we'll go into a scenario on what to do. So I'm coming into an area. This area is secured at this time because they have a autograph session that is on the first floor. So I'm approaching a father. He is out there, um, and he does not want to leave. So let's go with it. Sir? Unfortunately, at this time, this area is secure. So what I have to do is ask you to go down this way. If you go to section yeah, hey, 117. Hey, 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 my man, I'm going to cut you off right there. I pay for a ticket. Uh, We're going to hang out. We're going to take a couple pictures. Me and my kid going to hang out. And we're going to relax. And then we're going to head to the autograph section. So you can yeah, take all that. You can take all that and you happen. go somewhere else. No, sir. Hey, no, no. You can take all that you go somewhere sir, else. All right. I am a hey, professional. Carl Winslow. Sir, go find Urkel. Listen, leave me and my kid alone. Listen. Leave me and my I kid alone, bro. I out there. Hey, if no, we not leave. We not leave. What leaving. I will do we not is leaving. have you get arrested. All right, well, How about arrest that? Me. Arrest me. Do all right. It. So I see you want to pull your phone out. You don't want to talk about what you did, but... You you can't film me. I want you. No, nah, I'm gonna film me. No, I'm gonna film you. Film me. I'm gonna film me. What you going to do? What you going to do? What you going to do? I'm you. I'm filming. Listen, I'm, I'm about to sue you. I'm gonna call I'm the police. Sue you. I'll, call I'll, I'll get the police. I'll get you thrown out of here. Call him. All right. So I allowed him to bait me into a situation where I started acting the same level he did. That ain't what we want to do. What we want to do is stay professional. So we're going to do another scenario with him attacking me verbally and how you should act or try to act. Now, remember, you have resources. I have a radio. I have the ability to call for backup. So the first thing I would do if that situation uh, prior happened would be call for resources, get resources down there. Okay. And then we'll go from there. Sir. Unfortunately, at this time, this area is secure. They have an area on the yeah, first Yeah, hey, my floor man, I'm going to cut you, you off right go. there. Hey, my man, I'm going to cut you off right there. Me and my kid are here. We're hanging out. We're having a good time. We're not bothering nobody. Just let us do our thing, and then we're going to get up out of here. Yeah, right. unfortunately, uh, I'm going to have to ask yeah, you Unfortunately, leave. nothing. I know hey, you want to hey, have a I'm good time, my kid. but I kid. have a suggestion. Right. They have an autograph session on the first floor. You will be able to get a little closer it's just that they got another show in another hour nah, or two. Nah, nah, we're, we're so good we right here. To, That's a great suggestion. All right, so let me do That's this for you. Three, so oh, two, two, command. Oh, great. I'd like to see about getting a security manager. have a donut manager. party over here, guys. Yeah, get the cops involved. That's right, don't I'm recording. I have a job. I'm going to send this to corporate. I'm going to have your job, buddy. I'll have your job. So, unfortunately, right now, we have resources coming to this area. We have to secure this area. I know you want to have a good time, and I want you to have a good time. You know who I am? Not at Do you know who I am? My so dad will buy this company, buddy. That will be good. Hopefully, he will be able to employ us. But at this particular time, I have to ask you to leave, sir. So, two different scenarios, two different ways of handling. First thing I, I did when I seen it starting to go drifting to a different direction than I needed it to go is I called for backup, get the cavalry coming, have help coming into the area where you're at. So there's more than just you. 
You know they're trying to bait you. You know they're trying to get you to be unprofessional. Stay professional at all times, okay? You have to be courteous. You have to be professional. There comes times where, for whatever reason, if they push your button, you may have to take a step back and get someone else to handle the situation. There will be times where, for whatever reason, you two are not seeing eye to eye. If you back out of a situation and just say, hey, unfortunately, let me get someone else to talk to you, uh, never re-engage. Don't go back and say, oh, by the way, this, that, and the other. Once you back out, back out of the situation, stay there as a professional. You'll be there for the other person to come in and be a backup to them. But don't continue to engage. That's what they want you to do.